Fraxinus nigra, black ash. These are trees usually 50 to 60 feet tall when mature, with an open or pyramidal overall canopy shape. Foliage is deciduous and opposite, which is typical of ashes or Fraxinus. Leaf shape is pinnately compound, with 7 to 11 leaflets. Individual leaflets are oblong to oblong lance shaped. Individual leaflets are usually 3 to 5 inches long and 1 to 2 inches wide. The leaflet margins are serrate with small inwardly curving teeth. Fall leaf color of Fraxinus nigra is yellow. During the growing season, the foliage is dark green and smooth or glabrous above. The underside of the leaves are lighter green in color and often hairy at the base and on the midrib below. A key feature of Fraxinus nigra is that all leaflets except the terminal one are sessile, meaning that there's no petiole. Ornamental features of Fraxinus nigra include the ash gray or gray brown colored bark, which is often furrowed and blocky. It can also be seen as scaly or flaky, and the bark sets it apart from other members of Fraxinus. Another feature are the black buds, which gives the name black ash the common name for Fraxinus nigra. It tends to hold its leaves later into the fall than other Fraxinus species. Cultural information for Fraxinus nigra, it is hardy from zones 2 to 9, does best in full sun, can handle soil pH from 4 to 8, which is more acidic than typical, and it will also do well in alkaline conditions. Like other members of Fraxinus, it is beset by the emerald ash borer and is in great danger of being lost in our urban and natural areas. It's native in Iowa, as well as the northern central USA and Canada. Emerald ash borer is a major problem and ashes are in decline because of EAB. Fraxinus nigra tends to be a little less ornamental than other members of Fraxinus. However, it is also more tolerant of wet locations than other Fraxinus genera and is often found in river bottoms, cold swamps, and other low wet woodland areas.